Hello Wastelanders, Vlad here, and today I'm going to show you how to build a bay window for your camp, so let's get things going. To get things started, let's start with this um, floor plan. It's just a plus sign, and I've used some different colored foundations so we have a better guide for placing these other ones. And we're going to take a foundation and we're going to go at an angle uh, between this checkerboard foundation and this blue foundation. And I want the angle to start at the white line on that blue foundation and then go into till it touches the checkerboard one. I'm not really worried about where it touches the checkerboard one. That's just going to come out natural. Uh, make sure that your corner is in the white line, the very center of that blue foundation. That's why I chose that one because that center is very small, so it's going to be easier to line things up. And then once we've got those placed, we can double check them, make some last minute adjustments, check to make sure that they kind of touch the checkerboard one about the same spot. And then we're going to take our checkerboard one and we're going to push it forward and we're going to place it in between these two. And what we want is the corners of that checkerboard to just be touching the corners of the ones we placed at an angle. And this is going to form the shape of our bay window. And now we're going to remove these three middle foundations, but keep that back one. It is very important to keep that back one. Don't remove it. Now um, we're going to place a foundation on this and we're going to then place a barn half wall. I'm building with half walls. If you want to use a full wall, it doesn't matter what set you use, but make sure you're, if you're doing half walls to start with the barn half wall and it becomes important later um, in the build. And once you've placed those, kind of take a look. Make sure that they're kind of merging the way you want to. This one could be better, um, but it works for our example. So I'm not going to worry about fixing it, but uh, you can see where it has some deficiencies and you could fix that before you move forward. Now we're going to place our windows on top of our half walls. This is supposed to be a bay window, so we're going to use this uh, glass set. Then we're going to place roofs. We want to put it on the inside and then place one on the outside and then remove the one on the inside. So uh, make sure that you do this step and then double check those wall or roofs once you put them in place. Make sure they pivot to an angled roof right up against the wall. We don't want it angling or pivoting in a different area um, because that becomes important later on in the build. So make sure that uh, they pivot in the right area. Next, we're going to blueprint everything we've placed. We want all the half walls, we want all the foundations, we want all of the roofs to continue with the build. And make sure you get this last foundation. It is a pivotal point of what we do next. So make sure um, you keep that in the blueprint. Now we can delete everything and place our blueprint. And what's going to happen is it's going to place and it's going to flip those foundations and it's going to flip those roofs. Now the flip foundations aren't terribly important. We're actually going to remove those. But um, the roofs, getting them together like this is just easier than playing around with a flamethrower up in the sky to break them later. So um, I recommend keeping them as part of the blueprint. And then we're going to destroy all of our barn half walls. And that's going to allow us to remove all of these foundations from underneath. And then we're going to take our foundation that was part of the blueprint and build forward from it until we are underneath all of our little walls that are now floating. And uh, now that's forming the floor underneath the bay window. And then we're going to take a set of stairs and build off of the foundation right behind them. And then we want a half upper floor and we're going to then connect to a set of stairs going down again and place a foundation attached to the bottom of those stairs. And what we've effectively done with this is offset these set of foundations one half of a foundation from the ones in front. And that comes important for us getting walls that come together in a nice even uh, build scenario. So now we have four foundations in the back, three in the front, covering our bay window. We're going to put some uh, walls in place here. And now we have a little conundrum. We need to get some walls above these uh, roofs. So I'm going to switch these to angled so that I can get some catwalks to go across um, because I'm going to use the catwalks to get these uh, half walls floating in place. 
Uh, so let's go ahead and place some walls on this side and we're going to attach our catwalks to them. Now if these wall roofs were still flat, I wouldn't be able to place the catwalks, so I had to switch them to the angled ones. Uh, but now that they're angled and I have them in place, uh, I need to place the walls. So I need to then uh, make them flat again. And it's a lot of back and forth, but it's um, you know perfect for what we want to do, so we're just going to work through it. And then we're going to put our half walls coming across on top of our catwalks. Now there's other ways to get these in place if you don't own the catwalks. So keep that in mind. Uh, you can do some of the floating wall tricks that I showed in one of my recent build uh, camp trick videos. And I'll put that in the description so you know where you can find that. Now we're going to repair those walls, put them back to being something other than the barn set. And this is our result. Pretty nice. This is it with it being full glass and some decorations. I think it turned out pretty nice. But that's it. That's your bay windows. And hopefully this helps you out with your build. Now don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for the latest content from Vlad Administrator Gaming. And until next time, I'll see you in the wasteland.